Today we are going to learn how to make primers using Primer 3 software. For that purpose we will go to that site of Primer 3 in our browser. This is the welcome page of the Primer 3 web online software. So we have already a sequence for which we are des designing primers for our PCR. This is the sequence we will copy this sequence and paste into that side here this is the foster format sequence we are pasting in all the things all the setting remain normal as it is we have to pick a forward primer and a reverse primer okay we will give it a name sequence id and if we have any target when we will assign that specific target here but we have to um, only make primers for that sequence we leave these spaces empty okay in order to optimize the length we select the length 18 to 24 This, you can change the melting temperature here for the primers but I will leave as it is I will change the GC contents of the primer okay now we will go for the option pick primers here it is pick primers and now it is loading the work has done it has given us the sequence the left primer which starts at 82 nucleotides and its length is 20 nucleotide its melting temperature is 58 and its GC contents is 55 okay and the, here is a sequence of that primer this is the first prime for a forward primer and here is the reverse primer it starts as 282 it has shown here the first primer starts here and the second primer here other primers are here okay the first this is the power primer and this is the reverse primer so in order in order to amplify the large sequence we will use the first power primer that starts at 82 or going backward toward the sequence we will select this we start at the 63 nucleotide and the most for this uh, its reverse is, is we use this reverse in order to get a large amplicon because these are the different sequ sequences of primers which we obtain